Hey guys, it's about two in the morning and we have a guilt here who is farrowing out her piglets. And um, I just thought I'd do real quick a, a demonstration on how to do a manual exam. And by manual exam, it's when you reach inside of the sow's uh, vagina up into her pelvic canal and see if you can find any piglets that are stuck. Sometimes two will come down at the same time and kind of jam up there in the pelvic bones. Um, I videotaped this already, so I'm not exactly sure what it's gonna show, but um, hopefully I can do like a voiceover and explain what it is that I'm doing and that kind of thing. So here's the things that I use um, when I'm gonna do like a pelvic exam. First, I'll unzip my jacket and pull my arm out because we don't want our sleeves in the middle of this mess. We like to have our, our arms fairly clean. Um, and then I use these products here. Hang on, let me switch the camera around. Okay, so I use a glove on my hand like I have on this hand here. And then this is chlorhexidine solution. I like chlorhexidine. Some people will use uh, betadine or iodine, something like that. I prefer chlorhexidine and it's blue and it's usually a concentrate that you can dilute. And then I use a powdered J-lube. Um, and the way I do this is I put the glove on my hand and I run the liquid all over my hand, both sides, kind of smash it around with my fingers. Then I put the powder on there and when I do that, I rub that in and it makes it a very uh, lubricated surface so that when I go into the sow, like this, when you wanna, you wanna hold your hand like this, you wanna pull it into a, a you know, um, you wanna make it so that it's easy to go in, doesn't hang up on any of the tissue here. Ideally, you'd wanna wipe the vulva off, clean it off a little bit, point your hand like this, and then as you go in, just really go slow and feel around. You wanna feel for the main tunnel. There's a bladder that goes off to one side as well. You don't want to get stuck in there. So you just go in real slow. If she pushes, just hold your hand there and steady. When she relaxes, keep going. And one thing that I found that's a trick is you use the liquid here. And as you progress, you'll get to a point in your glove. And obviously I won't have my, hang on, I gotta pull my sleeve up. You wouldn't have your sleeve on, your uh, arm on, your sleeve on. But one thing you do is take your lubricant and put it here around your wrist. So as you go, you put a little bit more here around your arm so that you're not tearing any of this tissue in here. You want it to go in nice and smooth all the way up. You don't want to hit a dry spot on your wrist or your forearm and then start pushing on these tissues because you're going to tear her vulva up even worse. So that's basically how I do it. I'll attach a little um, clip here from above when I was actually trying to just catch the birth of a piglet and realized I had done that and thought, oh, well, maybe I'll make a little video about it. So hopefully this helps. If you have any questions, please do put them in the um, the comment section uh, below and I will try to answer them. I know that we get a lot of uh, kind of first time pig farmers that are trying to do some research and I'm more than happy to help because uh, raising pigs can be very satisfying and it's a lot of fun. So say bye guys.